What's up guys? Today we're taking a look at You're No Good from Van Halen. We're in E-flat or uh, half step down tuning, so if you don't know what that is, check it out in the link in the description. Uh, the guitar, it has some volume swells in the beginning, so you want to roll your guitar volume completely off, or if you're using a volume pedal, make sure that's completely off. Then we're going to come over here, 14th fret, we're going to bar strings 4, 3, and 2, or just 4 and 3, strum that once, and you're going to increase the volume, there's not much distortion on it, and then you're going to roll the volume back off. It's going to sound like this. From there we come over 12th fret, bar the same strings, do the same volume. 7th fret, bar the same strings, same volume. 5th fret, same strings, and this time when you increase the volume you leave it there and if you have a whammy bar which I don't you depress it take it out of tune and you increase your volume for more distortion for the main riff of the song now that takes us right to the main riff we're gonna start out here fifth fret we're gonna bar strings five and six strum that once and we're gonna hammer on the fifth string seventh fret From there, all you're really doing is fretting this 6th string 5th fret and 5th string 7th fret, strumming through 6 and 5 once. From there, 5th fret, we're barring strings 4 and 5, we're going to strum that once. And right from there, all you're doing is fretting the 5th string 5th fret, 4th string 7th fret, you're going to strum through 5 and 4 once. Then we come back over 5th fret and we bar strings 5 and 6, strum that once and do that same hammer on, on that 5th string 7th fret. And then we just come back to this 5th fret, rebar strings 4 and 5, strum that once. Now, the first time right after this part is slightly different. It, it's a different slide um, they do the second time around. So right after here, the first time, you're going to come down here, 7th fret. You're going to bar strings 3 and 4. You're going to strum that once, slide to the 8th, back to the 7th. And then over here to the 5th, you're going to bar strings 3 and 4 and strum that. And if you listen to the record, you can hear there's a distinct difference between the first and second time it's played around. So the second time around, it's going to be the same way, and I'll tell you where the changeup is. So that's uh, the exact same thing, but instead of coming down here to the seventh fret, we're going to be fretting the fifth string, fifth fret, and the fourth string, seventh fret. We're going to strum through five and four once, slide down to six and eight back to 5 and 7 sound like this and then right after that all we're gonna do is come over here to the fifth fret and we're gonna bar strings 3 and 4 and you're gonna strum through that once so to run through that second part it's just 